What is up mountain slugs? It has been four weeks since I was on this trail and broke two ribs, rib four and five. Um, I'm ready to get redemption on this trail. So <laughs> I don't know. If you, I don't know if you've ever broke ribs, but it absolutely sucks. Um, breathing is pretty essential to our lives. Uh, I do a lot of meditation and breathing exercises. So that was a total no go. Um, even being away from the bike was really upsetting. Uh, worked hard this last year to, to get in a lot better shape and lose weight. So it, was a, it felt like a huge setback for me. I was kind of really bummed for the first week. Uh, I was in a lot of pain, um, but it could have been worse. And I'm back on it today. So let's unload the bikes and let's hit this trail and get this thing whipped. All right, so this is where I wrecked. And looking back, I mean, I come through those trees pretty fast. I was hauling butt, but it looks really steep. I didn't realize it was a steep. I mean, granted there was like three inches of snow on the ground, but um, right here is where I made my mistake. I should have pushed hard into here and come around, but there's not a whole lot to hold speed right here. So I was up here my front tire started washing like this and I fell and landed on this here and then continued to roll and slide. They thought I'd broke my arm because I think that took that and that pushed my arm up into my rib cage and popped everything. But it was kind of funny because the day I did it, there was guys framing these houses right here. And uh, I remember as I was trying to like breathe because it totally knocked the wind out of me worse than I've ever had it. The nail gun stopped. So I'm sure they got a pretty good show. And then once I kind of like started moving and Xander came down and helped me, they, you'd hear him nail, pop, pop, pop. But before I remember they were just going to town. So I'm sure they got a good, uh, a good show of me hobbling my sorry ass out of here to get to the truck to go to the ER. So anyway, let's climb to the top of this bad boy and have some fun. Peel the jacket finally because I was overheating. So, a couple more switchbacks. We up at the top, and we'll be riding Mojo. We'll loop that a couple times, and then we're actually going to come back down this trail and call it a day. So, let's keep on riding. Go. Sanders should be good to go.
to the top. Sick. Felt good, guys. Felt really good. Oh, man. I'm like high right now just from being able to do that. It's, oh my gosh. It's so fun. High on life. When I was meditating this morning, I meditated that I could just ride and that this would be flowy. It would feel good. And it felt great. That was awesome, dude. Yeah. That was sick. back up the top and do it again maybe a couple times feeling pretty good right now and the way back's all downhill so we can definitely spend some energy it's crazy because not last time we rode this but the first time we rode this during the summer by the time I hit here I was totally gassed so my fitness has come a long ways so Really grateful for that. This hard work is definitely paying off. It's just a compound effect, right? Keep doing it slowly but surely. Your body will change. And your fitness level will change. Of course, you hit plateaus, and this is where you gotta dig deep and just push and break through them. Sometimes they come through, you break through when you're not, you know, hammering it. Sometimes it's when you take a day off, you break through that plateau. So, just gotta listen to your body. Try not to get frustrated with yourself. Easier said than done. I know I've been plenty frustrated with myself at certain times. But, good day today. Every day's a good day, honestly. All right, Mountain Slugs, we have looped Mojo twice. It was awesome. We've got some really good footage to show you. Um, we're gonna loop this back up and head back home, probably get some footage on the way back down, but I'm glad to be riding the ribs. They're a little sore, but way better than I was figuring. For four, four weeks past the injury, I'm doing pretty well, I feel. So um, I hope you're safe. I hope you're riding rubber side down. Keep inching your way to the top, and thanks for watching. See you next time.